Hey, so William, uh, thank you for posting on Indie Hackers about your website, which is called itini.com. So, I don't know if you've posted this before, and you're basically back here because you think that things have changed and you would like to have a little bit of feedback because too much text. So here comes the improvement post that you've always dreamed of. If you like this video that I'm about to make, please consider subscribing to my channel. I'm trying to reach a 100 followers so that I can unlock some fun stuff on YouTube. So let's have a look. Itini, plan your trip, track your coast, see the world. And there's an about page and there's a pricing pay. Okay, so first things first. Uh, landing page, home page. Plan your trip, track your coast, see the world. So your app is to plan trips and tracking the cost of trips. So it's a trip planner. So maybe your he your header should say a little bit more straightforward and say the trip liner, sorry, the trip planner that you know, you've always dreamed of or a trip planner for real people or whatever, something like that. Um, a simple trip planner that you will love. That also could work. You need to make it a little bit more straightforward because, you know, this is kind of like a dreamy headline and dreamy headlines don't really sell. So try and use trip planner as a word probably works better because it gives you immediately an idea of what your homepage is going to be about. It could be something like your trip planner on steroids or the most powerful trip planner you've, you'll ever use, something like that. Even if it's, you know, maybe it's not the most powerful in the world, but maybe this is the start of a really powerful tool. So, okay, ditch the messy spreadsheet and scattered bookmarks, whether you're a solo traveler, vacationing with friends, itini makes it easier that ever to plan the trip of your dreams so yeah you can definitely shorten all of this and you know highlight the stuff that makes sense you know like ditch spreadsheet and bookmarks uh itini makes it extremely simple to plan the trips of your dreams or to try to rather to plan trips alone or with friends right you already saved half I'm sure you can compress this even more. Basically, when you do a headline that tells you, you know, the best, the best about, you know, your trip planner is the best, then what you want to say is why it is the best, right? So you'll say no more spreadsheet, no more bookmarks, and then something, something with friends or alone. Um, so here's a screenshot of your, of your tool. And this is, you know, this is huge. It's huge. It's it's humongous. And I wish I could actually zoom into this because there's a lot of things going on and I can't really see them. Um, so I wonder, I wonder, is there anything you can do in this section right here to make it look like bigger? Um, I don't know, maybe. Try iTini for free. Okay, something I would do about your call to action definitely make the call to action a different color because what happens is it blends too much with the background I know it's nice to have the maximum you know um, the maximum brightness or whatever the contrast rather but you want to make it I don't know what color could work maybe yellow so it kind of like looks like lime uh, but that's you know it, it jumps out to my eye way more than on a white background it probably doesn't um, okay, so continuing this, let's see, let's see, let's see, don't think again you can afford a trip right now, think again. Modern vacation is full of expenses, you know, hotels, fly, restaurant, ride sharing can be hard to track, la 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 la, that's where it comes in, track every expense. Okay, so tracking expenses, for every person on your trip, water, travel apps may help you plan, but your trip is more than airplanes, all those taxis, la la la. The only way to know if you can afford your next trip is to know how much it costs. The only way to know how much it costs is with itini. Okay, definitely drop this line and all this text here. So, don't think you can afford a trip right now, think again. 
Itini uh, tells you immediately um, if you can afford your next trip by tracking all of your expenses and not just your airplanes and room service. There, there you go. I just summed all of this, right? Okay, now stop stressing, start planning. So this is kind of like, you know, the page breaks here. There's something here. Is I feel like you wanted to create a new section. Um, something that you can do here is instead of look making this FAQ looking like section, you could you should actually have some more screenshots of your app. So I really want to travel, but it always seems expensive. So these are obviously issues that people have, right? Like, oh, I wish I could travel, but I don't have any money. It's too expensive. So you're definitely addressing issues that people um, have in their heads when they go before planning travel. And I think your app could totally help them, but you should show them how. So instead of having like all this wall of text, maybe maybe you can just show what feature of your app, app you know, like this, you know, this view, like I'm sure there's some features in here that you could place here in a little caption underneath that says, uh, you know, a zip, a zipped ver compressed version of this text here. I'm planning a trip for a group, but it's hard to keep track of how much it will cost. So here again, you could be like, Itini helps you track expenses, you know, from A to Z for every person down to the cent, yada, yada, yada. And that's all you get to say and show the screenshot where you do like people management, right? Like expense management for for attendees. Uh, there's so much I want to do on my trip. It's hard to figure out. Okay, so you have a map viewer. So again, you can show a screenshot of your map viewer um, where you have like different pins dropped and like things to do and how long it's going to take, etc, etc. And then that way people will be like, oh, so there's a map feature. And then they're going to, you know, go like go from back from the top, you know, like, okay, so, oh, so there's a money planner. Oh, okay. There's like a breakdown per person. Oh, there's a activity planner. Okay. These are three cool features that you should totally advertise, not just like write text. Nobody reads text. Because I feel like the most important thing about your your homepage is yes, there is too much text, but also the contrast of this text, it's way harder to read than your than your H1s. So people will definitely read your H1s, but when it comes to your paragraph, they'll be like, uh uh uh, you know, they'll be like that, and then you'll be like, oh crap, you know. So I wrote all that for nothing. So make it a little bit. See how easier it is to read when it's like or six, whatever it was, versus this, it's, it, it makes a whole difference. And of course, this is too much text. Then finally, last part of your page, you have this huge call to action. I would bring it more central. And I like that you say, hey, it's free. You know, it's this is definitely personalized, no credit card, it's free. Ooh. Pricing, I, I've never seen anyone do price like that. This is weird. If pricing like this and then you, you have like two options here there's no button like what if i just want to you know click here and buy it boom straight out i can't it's and then there's some kind of like faq text right but most people that do this kind of stuff you know what they do is um they will do like two cards left and right or three cards rather they'll have like a freemium a uh, basic plan and an advanced plan and everybody's gonna go for either free or they're going to buy the the cheaper one right that's why people add those and then through their lifetime they might evolve and buy the expensive one um all right so now let's watch your about page okay immediately here i would put a picture of yourself uh in december 2019 my wife and i took a trip to chicago this is a great you know, it's a great place to put a picture of yourself and your wife when you went to Chicago. It gives you so much more powerful um, in, t in terms of storytelling. I mean, the storytelling is way more powerful when there's actual picture. Uh, um, went to a submarine, so dolphins, all this is cool. So people will probably read this because they'll be like, oh yeah, I, this, you know, this res resonates with me. It's just like me. I know how to make a spreadsheet. Da, 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 da. You want to use like typography here to make like some things like come out, you know, more. And then there's no call to action here. There needs to be something. Maybe a video of you using iTini and planning your first trip so you onboard people kind of like from your about page or something like that. 
and then we already discussed about the pricing okay i hope uh this definitely is a great start you can definitely condense the text and you can do some changes but hope this feedback video helped again if you think this helped please just sub to my youtube channel it means a whole world to me uh other than that have a great afternoon or day after evening night whatever and i'll see you in the next video